asked him for something earlier on. I'm hoping that he's gonna uh, sort me out. Yeah, right, so the lay account, I'm at 359. Right. That's, I've got 3,000, so that's quite, uh, that's 10%, roughly, just over 10%. So uh, I'm doing pretty well. Um, the way creating vinyls like this can make them quite layer heavy. But I'm not planning on doing too much else on the side. The rest will be more the Venom text uh, and then some, some uh, symbiote style paint effect over the top of it I think um, so I don't need to worry about the layers I sh I'll be fine even once I've done all the teeth which will be loads um, they I won't need to worry about the layers so <coughs> teeth once I've done his teeth that will give me rather than do his tongue and then have to do his teeth around it what I'll do is I'll do his teeth and then that will leave me space to fit a tongue in. And it might need to move him, that's in the way slightly. I find that yellow there. That I just picked, I'll just show you again. Uh, this one here is a very good naturally born ivory teeth colour because then you can lighten it or darken it wherever you want. Well, uh, me and Boss, thanks Helios, uh, me and Boss have been chatting, working together for a little while. Uh, it is, yeah, actually, yeah, you're right, it is. I mentioned that a little while earlier on now. That uh, it's one of the best communities. And me and Bus have been kicking about a good few months now. Um, <laughs> he wanted 10, did he? Well, I didn't know that. I just know that he asked me what for one. So, Yeah, he asked me for a pin. And uh, having done... It was Fozathon. I worked with DTI Bebop for his Fozathon event. And through that I think Bus got in touch and asked for a livery and it's basically escalated and snowballed from there. Uh, he also was speaking to me, we worked together for when he was discussing his uh, spray bomb idea and stuff uh, uh, and I was in like the first five episodes I think or something like that. Uh, I did mine on the CLK GTR, the Mercedes. Uh, usually I would have gone with a Ferrari, because I'm properly obsessed with them. But uh, I went for something different. I tried to be different this time. Right, so he's got quite long teeth, and I'm building them too small. So I'm going to have to actually make them a bit bigger. And I'm probably actually going to make them black, just to work with them a bit better. the most viewers I've ever had on Twitch 31. Nice. Uh, a question for the painters, which game do you find it better to paint on? Uh, 5 or Horizon 2? I think so too. I I recently did a paint job on five yesterday actually, um, and it just it runs a lot better than than Horizon does when you when you're shaping things and filling things in and that. It just 
It feels like everything is slower to move about on this, like the controls are heavier. Plus you can see the car a bit better as well. Yeah, the layer count started to become a big issue for me in 4. So it's great that 5 has got so many. Although I've still maxed out a couple ones. I was doing a, a livery, an Alfa Romeo livery recently for the 4C. And I was doing a big martini snake. It was actually for the photographer's idea. But I had to scrap that because I didn't have an, I couldn't work out how I would do the scales while still having enough layers left on the car. I, I just could not work it out and end up just having to give it up. Lightmare. A bit longer. I think whoever made Venom with so many teeth needs to be shot. is my favourite Marvel character. I have a Venom tattoo on my shoulder actually. Yeah, it's Venom. His teeth are actually probably going to need to be a touch bigger as well. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue building them at this size. Uh, check out Forza Motorsport 4. I might have uh, a good carnage one on there. Uh, yeah, I'm going to continue building them this size and then just resize them all once I've finished. That way they're all the same scale and I don't have to mess about trying to make sure that I make the next ones bigger or well, slightly longer. Yeah, I'll be up for that. I'll take a, a little break in a, a little while. Times it anyway. About 10 minutes, I'll take a 5 minute break or 2 minute break or something. Probably 2 minute break. And uh, I'll, I'll show some cars while I'm doing that. Luckily, his teeth don't run all the way along his jawline. They only run to just pass, just about halfway around that curve that I'm coming up to. So... I'm all right. His bottom teeth. There, there's a lot more of them. <laughs> uh, I'm putting it on a Challenger, a Dodge Challenger. looked away and nice uh, suddenly there's uh, loads of stuff <laughs> to see <laughs> well, uh, thanks Helios actually not that many on this uh, I've got 25 shared but not all of them are showstoppers so uh, but on Forza 5 I've, with me being on it yesterday I noticed the wealth of material that's on there Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> I asked for La Ferrari and the uh, Gibson slash vintage original series Les Paul. It's like twelve grand.
Well, he is Canadian, so he is pretty far up north. He might be able to organize that, you know. I'm going to do one more, a smaller one, and that's the top one's done. And again, I'm just going to highlight all of these, group them, save it. Actually, no, I need to readjust them, don't I? <laughs> his hands were probably too cold to take off his gloves to do it. Yeah, actually, I was in uh, the Halloween Week in Review. It's my first one. My first Week in Review. Been reading them since Forza 4. It's the first one I've been in. I can show you the car if you want. I've saved this, so give us a sec. I've been in a couple of in features now, actually, for the photographer. Right, uh, car select. No, I want my cars. We're looking for a Lamborghini. This was in. Uh, this is the one that was in the uh, week in review. With uh, the wolf on the bonnet as well. It's difficult to see sometimes. You have to get the camera angle right. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> uh, the colour of the wheels was picked to reflect like uh, the moon a bit. So that's why I used the same blue as well. I can get close up. The best way for me to show you actually would be probably to get in it and uh, go into the vinyl editor. <laughs> I think I pressed the wrong thing. I just come out with it, I did. So what are we doing to your ride today? There, that's the, that's the best you can get like that, my friend. Cheers, photographer.